underway very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. So the players and officials stand tall for the anthem. Saint-Germain have chosen to go 4-3-3. Well, it's a system that promotes width, Peter. The wide men can stretch the fences and just create that running room for others. Interesting. Ericsson. Kane with a delicate ball. Lusa Sissoko. Great lead! Harmlessly behind. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Marco Verratti. And it's Neymar. Paris Saint-Germain very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Deli Alley, Eriksson looks to slip it through. Son Hyung Min. Son Hyung Min with the cross. It's a corner kick. onto it but the finish is all wrong oh it was such a clever pass that flummoxed the defense and it could well be revisited this Drexler so they got the 
only goal to give them a 1-0 lead. Kazawa goes long. Dicks one in. Big chance here! Some are shouting for a corner, but the referee says goal kick. Neymar, nicely controlled. Neymar brings the ball forward. It's a loose ball. Thiago Silva. Now the pass. Deli Alley. Song Kyung Min. 15 minutes till half time. Just brushed off the ball there. Trippier. Now it's Kane. Plays it into the channel. Song Kyung Min. Whipped in. In once more. Shakes the shoots. It's missed, but not by that far. Christian Eriksen did give it a fair old crack and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Kuzawa. Marquinhos. Thiago Silva. Paris Saint-Germain are leading with half-time drawing close. Now it's Cavani. Oh, the ball's come loose! Cavani might well be in for a mouthful from his boss if his teammates don't get there first. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. That's going to be a booking. It's a little unfortunate, he had a lot of people worried then. Marco Verratti. Kuzawa. Neymar. Deli Alley. Crunching tackle. Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. He gets a ticking off and needs to be very careful now. Yeah, and he has to change his ways, or this referee could soon change his status. It's half time. There we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Paris Saint-Germain leading 1-0 at the break. Already up and running for the second half. Paris Saint-Germain going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. That's a foul, and the whistle's gone. There could be trouble here. For now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. To profit from it, he's made sure that that won't get through. Trippier, Deli Ali, 
Ja. And Son Kyung Min has been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Tongan gets into the right position to intercept. Now it's Cavani, goes wide. Neymar looking to get on the end of this. And he's there to cut it out. Oh, goes for goal! Oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Deserved a better ending. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Kuzawa. There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. He's got away! It's a brilliant interception. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. That's surely a foul free kick. Well, that looks like a final warning, still no card. He's been given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered gets up to head it. Could fall kindly. And in it goes. Two ahead. Late in the day. Game over, surely. Maurice reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. But that's one of the first things you learn whether you're a striker or not. Just anticipate a goalkeeping parry or spillage. Sometimes you'll get lucky and it'll come your way. Paris Saint-Germain themselves a two-goal cushion. Diane spreads it towards the left. to win it back. Questions were asked. He's given the answers. Aim blow and direct. Tries a through ball. Cavani looking to get on the end of this.
the change here. Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Marco Verratti. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. He's left his man. It's Llorente. Llorente is fouled. The referee has shown him a yellow card. I just think it was a, a cheap foul to give away. Saint-Germain can be very happy with a job well done, an efficient win for which the players simply did enough. Have you look back on the game?